Hello everyone, JRDL96 here with a brand new unboxing and as you can tell it's another Cloak brand unboxing. Now the last related unboxing we did from Cloak brand was more recently with the, you know, Woods flannels. These, this flannel here and the beanie. By the way, I wore this flannel when I met Jacksepticeye and he, liked, he complimented me on that. I thought that was pretty cool. So here we are with another one from one of the recent collections called Plush. <laughs> I was assume, I was expecting them to actually sell actual teddy bears. I, I don't know why, but I felt like that that was what they were planning on doing anyways. Based on the, you know, Plush name and everything, you would think Plush Bears or, you know, Plushies or Plushie Dolls, you know? But I guess not. <laughs> so anyways, let's get right, right into this unboxing now. How much do you want to bet that we're going to get the same exact stickers that we have gotten over and over again? Because I guarantee you we probably will. Oh. <laughs> we got a card. <laughs> uh, the lovers. This is disturbing. <laughs> You want to play a game? Lovers? This is the lovers. All right. Anything else? Yep. Look at that. Pretty much the same ones. Oy vey. Never, never stops. So let's get into this and see what we got. I've always wanted to get one of these, you know. Oh, this is cool. Oh, wow, this is interesting. The design here is pretty interesting. Oh, there goes the silicone gels. So what we have here is the Cloak brand cl clouds plush, you know, pullover hoodie. I've always wanted to own like a hoodie from Cloak brand, so I, I was like, you know what, might as well just get this. What's interesting about this is that like some parts of it are more rough, like it's as if it's turned inside out. And then there are areas that are not. That are pretty no they're pretty much normal so i like that you know element to it seems like the back the sleeves and the half portion of you know the front have this like inside out aspect to it it has cloak right here pretty cool and it has this cool little tag here and it has this uh, little tag here that reads Plush uses ultra soft fleece flipped inside out. I was right. Creating a fuzzy ultra soft feel on the exterior with a smooth soft interior. Comf level is mental. <laughs> okay then. So um that's cool. This is a large by the way. So anyways, let's try this on, shall we? So this is what the hoodie looks like. Very nice, very comfortable. And I can see that, you know, the sleeves, you know, are inside out. It's like pretty weird, but it's pretty cool actually. I like this. Pretty cool stuff. Pretty, you know, soft on the inside. I just noticed that there is a tag literally on the hood of the cloak. <laughs> Of this hoodie that I found that pretty funny oh Jesus <laughs> this hoodie this hood the hood itself is pretty <laughs> huge okay uh, thumbnail pose over so anyways that is it on this unboxing of this cloak plush cloud uh, pullover hoodie very cool. And the reason why I got this was because of the tie-dye elements to it. 
It actually kind of reminds me of the one hoodie that I got from an AEW wrestling show. Almost looks similar in color, but I think it's this one is a little bit darker compared to the cloak one itself. So that, that's what it reminded me of. So I was like, you know what? I might as well just get a cloak hoodie. That was like another thing that I've always wanted was a cloak hoodie. So I finally got my hands on one. Now I can scratch that off the uh, cloak bucket list. <laughs> Now I'm just waiting for the day they actually do an actual like tie-dye collection. You know, that's just all tie-dye related shirts with like a tie-dye like cloak logo. That's what I'm like hoping they do. But who knows. Um, so anyways, that's really it on this unboxing. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Now the only ones remaining is Lixian and Distractable. Distractable, I got an email saying that the stress ball is still in, you know, having some production issues and they were thinking about maybe um, shipping the other item I have, which is just a t-shirt, separately and then they will ship me eventually the stress ball. But I don't want to do that. Like, I don't want to do that. I do remember there was a Markiplier unboxing where they shipped me the t-shirt separately and the sock separately. It was 2017, too. It was the t Tiny Box Tim Glow in the Dark shirt, and then the Markiplier socks were shipped separately. I do remember that. So, yeah. Pretty interesting stuff. But anyways, that's really it on this unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, share this video with your friends. Be sure to ring that bell to be part of the notification squad. Be sure to check out my Instagram, because I make cool ads at Markiplier, Jack Septiguy, myself. I also an actress cosplays on there, so go check it out. Be sure to check out my Tumblr and my Discord in the description as well. So until next time, JRDL96 signing out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!